In our continuing coverage, it's been an ongoing problem since the pandemic. The Valley's need for first responders who rush to your 911 calls. Last year, the county fined ambulance companies AMR and Medic West for some delays in response times. An ambulance must respond to your call within 11 minutes, 59 seconds. And eight months later, the company that manages those ambulances says the same challenges exist. But now there's a better understanding of a bigger overall problem. Still not enough people signing up to work as a paramedic. 11 minutes, 59 seconds, 90% of the time. That's the ambulance response time required by Clark County and the fire department for all 911 calls. There are even more calls than ever in an ever growing valley and a greater acknowledgement of an ongoing challenge. We need more paramedics mm -hmm. yesterday, um, if not last year. The shortage that we're seeing isn't exclusive here to Southern Nevada. We're actually seeing it nationwide, where we were able to sit down and say, we're not finding any paramedics. What can we do to really enhance the system? And AMR still has trouble filling openings. Now the county is working with the large ambulance company to adapt to staffing shortages, changing who responds to a 911 call. Match the patient with the acuity level that they're experiencing. So if they're having chest pain, they'll get a paramedic. But if they're having flu-like symptoms, they may see an AEMT. And what that does is really allows paramedics to run those higher acuity calls. Damon Schilling says the change do not diminish the quality of your care, but since there's such a shortage of paramedics who have the highest level of training in hospitals, the company's making sure those first responders go where they're needed most. There are other trained emergency medical technicians and advanced EMTs able to respond as well. Still get an ambulance to you in a timely manner and make sure that you get to the hospital for that higher level of care service. So the change is going to effect on July 27th. The county plans to review it every 30 days to see how it's working. AMR also has an Earn While You Learn program to be a first responder. Details are on our website, foxavegas.com.